Alright guys, welcome back. We're approaching Raleigh where that line of weather is. Hit on our XM. Rain really hard off to my left. Anyways, that's what the XM is painting. That's a 20 mile ring ring right there. We'll go to my actual radar. It's showing it a little bit lighter than what it's showing on XM, which is good. Some of the heavy stuff over there. We'll trust this because this is live, real time radar. Fans are still howling like crazy. Denver 5263, Raleigh departure, radar contact. Delta 1896, contact Washington Center, 135.2. That's 35.2. Southwest 1494, Raleigh approach, expect runway 23 left. Ideally, we'd get past this weather when we turn left go around that a little bit, but they're not going to let us do that because their departure's off of 2-3 and we're going to be right in the way, but just continue on the way we're doing. Okay, I'm going to try to lean it back again to the Lena Peak side, which is about 13.2. Never 5263, turn right, heading 320, climb and maintain 1-2000. November 3, Delta Delta, moderate to heavy precipitation at your, say, 10 to 2 o'clock, and 1 5 miles is basically over Raleigh Airport. Okay, 3 Delta Delta. Any chance we could deviate to the left or we'll be in the way of your departures? November 3, Delta Delta, fly heading 280, back for weather. Okay, 280, 3 Delta Delta. Southwest Delta Delta, fly heading 270. Okay, 270, 3 Delta Delta. Endeavor 5263, turn right direct. Hey, that's much Correction. better. Turn right heading Get away zero from that mess. 50. Continue on this heading for about 20 miles would be good, right? About 20 miles. Endeavor 5263, when able, direct BEXCO, resume the BEXCO 3 departure. Endeavor 5263, contact Washington Center, 118.75. It's whistling in the background. Like whistling when you go past the graveyard, I guess. You can see me on that radar. Here's my ADSB. It's looking good, right? Southwest 1494. Right Approach 124.9 or 5. Looking good. 
you guys concur with that? Some of that stuff's getting really intense over to the right. I'm glad I asked. <laughs> so I just hammer down through there. Because looking at our XM, our XM weather, that didn't really show up, right? So I would have blindly went through there, but I just used the next red. So there's the advantage of having an actual radar on board for sure. All right, guys, well, I'm going to let you go. I'm going to ease on around this little bit of weather. We may be back with you for the approach into Greensboro. Two.